so hello everybody welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome back to my new brand and very interesting video so guys today in this video i am going to be tell you that how to fix iCloud photos has not updated in 35 days and internet connection is required to update iCloud photos so how you can fix this problem in this video i'm going to be tell you so first of all you have to simply close this page and you have to simply go back to the home screen and simply if you are in my channel then please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for my new video so guys if my video was informative and very interesting for you then please you have to press on the like button and you have to write comment on my video so without wasting any time let's get started with the videos first fully what you have to do you have to follow the first method so you have just open your setting app and from here what you need to do you have to tap on the apple id profile here after that from here you have to just simply scroll it below and here you have to sign out your apple id for one time and after that you have to simply go back and you have to again sign in your apple id so after sign out your apple id and again sign in your apple id now you have to simply go back to the home screen and simply check that your problem has been fixed or not so guys it's still not working and you are still facing this error so i will tell you next method to solve the problem now simply what you have to do you have to just open your setting app and from here you have to simply scroll it below and here you have to type on the general option and here you have to type on the shutdown and now here you have to slide to power off your device for some minutes and restart your device again here and you have to enter your iphone passcode so here i will put the password here after restart your device now you have to simply go back and simply check that your problem has been fixed or not so guys it's still not working and you're still facing this error so i will tell you next method to solve your problem now you have to just simply scroll it below now here type on again general and here you have to type on the transfer or reset iphone and now here you have to type on the reset option and here you have to type on the reset all setting after that here enter your iphone passcode so here i will put the password here now here you have to again tap on the reset all setting and then go back to the home screen and simply check that your problem has been fixed or not so guys from all this method i hope your problem has been fixed if your problem has been fixed then please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for my new video so hope this helped thanks for your time today and i will see you on the next one